Hey guys, so many of you wrote in with some really great answers for my 1,000 subscriber giveaway. It was really hard just to pick one winner. I had to narrow it down to my favorite 10, and then I had to ask some of my favorite artists and my editor to chime in to help me decide. In the end, though, we did pick one winner. So, um, we'd like to congratulate Boss Goose, and here's their reply. I'm really excited about the colors in this giveaway. Skin tones, yes! I can't find a wide variety of markers where I live, out in the middle of the country, lol, and I'm always a little nervous about investing in ordering art supplies I haven't used before. I haven't used alcohol markers much before. I have some water-based. I feel a little bad that I've been watching your stuff, watching, reading your stuff for a while and only just signed up for a YouTube account so that I could enter the giveaway. Sorry for being a lurker, but I guess I, I guess something finally had to give me that push. I want to talk about prompt four because I want to express something that something that it took forever to get through my head, partially because I have very little formal training when it comes to art, and I think it is important. Something I always used to do is save my coloring supplies for art I felt looked good enough to be worth coloring. I think this is the worst thing to do. Everyone tells you to practice, practice, practice to improve, but you really have to take this to heart, both with actual rendering and with coloring and completing a piece. I made limited improvement for the longest time because I felt like my drawing wasn't worth the effort of the next step. This is silly. You have to practice to improve, and it is so much more fun to play with all your supplies instead of saving them for something you think is good enough to be a completed piece. Maybe I'm the only one who felt this way, but I think it's important to express. Well, Boss Goose, I was guilty of the same thing. I still can be guilty. I have a Udo printer and um, like this uh, circuit ink and I have all these cool things that I keep saving for the right idea. So your response really spoke to me and it encouraged me to start using the materials that I've been hoarding for a while. So thank you a lot. Um, and they ended with good luck to everyone and congrats to whoever the win winner turns out to be. So congrats, Boss Goose. I can't wait to see what you make with these markers and I can't wait to watch you grow. Since so many of you were courageous in your answers, giving responses that took took heart to post and generously sharing advice that's helped you through hard times. I wanted to bring the spotlight to you as well. I would love to share some of my favorite answers on the blog as a text post. So runners up are going to receive a digital copy of the first volume of my watercolor comic, Seven Inch Kara, via Gumroad as a thank you. I'll contact the winners with a message on YouTube with their download link. So winners, I humbly request that you please don't share the link publicly. If you enjoyed this contest and would like to see more giveaways on this channel, please do me a huge favor and signal boost my channel to your social media. Sharing videos with friends, fans, and family helps me grow my audience, which means we hit giveaway milestones sooner. I have plans for a 2.5K and 5K giveaways coming up that include comic making supplies and watercolors that you guys don't want to miss out on. And if you're interested in sponsoring a contest like this with me as a host, please let me know that as well. This was a lot of fun and I'm excited about upcoming giveaways. This giveaway was sponsored by my Patreon at patreon.com slash nettosoup as well as my blog, Nettosoup's Studio Art and Process blog at nettosoup.blogspot.com. For more information on fun art education videos and content please check those out so I hope you guys enjoyed the 1k giveaway um, thank you so much to all of you who did enter thank you so much for being honest and brave with me I really really appreciate it I read all of your answers there was like hundred and thirty two comments I read all of them then I selected my favorite 10 and I I sent those out for um, additional um, input because they were just so great. It was so close. It was hard for me to decide. So if you didn't quite make it this giveaway, make sure you um, keep an eye out for 2.5k and 5k because I'm giving away goodies. Thank you guys so much. I'll see you later. Bye.